Ball State Sports LinkedIn, presented by First Merchants Bank. Welcome to this edition of Ball State Sports LinkedIn for March 25th, 2010. I'm Peter Carr. Wednesday, the softball team extended their winning streak to three games, sweeping the Dayton Flyers 7-2 in the first game and 5-0 to wrap up the doubleheader. Amanda Muntalto led the cards on the afternoon, combining for five RBIs and two home runs. Heading from the diamond to the hard court, the women's tennis team returns home for the first time in three weeks. The cards look to snap a two-match losing streak when they face Mac Foe Bowling Green on Friday at 1 p.m. and on Saturday against Western Michigan, also at 1. Staying on the hard court, the men's tennis team is on the road this weekend at Boise State Invitational on Saturday and Sunday. Coming off a narrow victory over Eastern Michigan last weekend, the gymnastics team heads to Bowling Green for the Mid-American Conference Championships on Saturday. And after losing 11-5 at in-state foe, Notre Dame baseball looks to rebound this weekend when they head to Athens, Ohio for a three-game series with the Bobcats. The series opens Friday night at 6. After winning both matches last weekend, the men's volleyball team returns home to face number 3 Cal State Northridge on Friday and Saturday. Now, Jamie and Hartley spent his first season at BSU on the bench, and this year he is very happy with his new role on the team. I think it's the fire that I had. You know, I just really want to play. I want to play every single game. I want to play every single minute. And, you know, just just want to be out there with the guys. You know, and win. I just love the sport. <laughs> to see the full Jamie and Hartley story, tune into the SportsLinks broadcast of men's volleyball on Saturday at 7:30 on BallStateSports.com. And the football team started practice Wednesday afternoon, and one story this spring will be how head coach Stan Parrish will handle the three running backs next season. For more on football, tune into SportsLink's preview show on WIPB April 17th. That does it for this edition of LinkedIn, and once again, we'd like to thank our friends at First Merchants Bank. You can visit them at firstmerchants.com. I'm Peter Carr, and now you're LinkedIn.